Okay, I will explain my diet lifestyle by saying I only eat, well, I eat fruits and vegetables and stuff, but as far as meat wise, I only eat salmon or other fish. My name is Nicole. I personally started off with being a vegetarian with Destiny when she started in January, but um, it's kind of hard for me to be strictly a vegetarian, so I'm more of a pescatarian. I do eat seafood. Um, but a lot of things, even with that, you have to watch out as far as your processed foods, even your fruits and vegetables that you get because they're loaded with pesticides and um, hormones and all kinds of stuff. So you just really try to find the most natural source where you live as far as what you eat. Your chain grocery stores are going to have stuff that's literally banned in other countries, but we grow up thinking so just being able to find stuff that's more natural. No, I do not meal plan at all. I kind of just go with the flow. No, I do not meal plan at all. I should. <laughs> I wish I could. But time. You definitely have to uh, make time. You have to, I don't think, can't think of a word for it. Be disciplined. It takes a lot of discipline as far as finding your time. I'll get on a roll and do it for a week and then it, yeah. So today I'm at Ann's Produce Market. I think that's what it's called. I'm sorry if I did it wrong. But I'm about to go get some fruits and vegetables to make my meal plan. I'm kind of tired. I don't grocery shop. I basically don't. Um, if I find something on the shelf, I pick it up. And I usually, I don't know, it's usually salmon or like other stuff. I don't really eat. Honestly, that's bad, but I don't really eat, man. I wing it a lot of times. Um, but I mean, the things that I do plan out is whenever we have, you know, in our area, we have the farmer's markets in Surfside, or we have one in North Myrtle, or I know the things that I need to travel go there to get um, and then the things that I can't find at a local market I have to go to the grocery store and just kind of work with what's there. One of the meals that I'm making is my quinoa and pepper meal. This is what quinoa, um, rice, and peppers. That's pretty much it. I think eating healthy is expensive that's why I kind of don't recommend it unless you have a good, I don't say good job, but or you gotta learn how to work your way around it and get deals and buy stuff in bundles. Because if you don't, you be spending more on like cheap meals. If that makes sense. I don't know. Um, medication is also expensive as well. Um, so I mean, eating healthy might cost a little bit more, but you're you're taking care of your body. It's definitely worth it. I mean, you're gonna go out and spend two hundred dollars on a pair of shoes, right? Or you know, spend thousands of dollars on a new cell phone. Why not spend the money to to take care of yourself? It's almost starting off. I would just say, don't try to just go hardcore and no meat because that's not realistic. I would just say probably start off as like maybe just turkey meat or like plant-based meat or something small, don't just go straight at it because it's not really good because your body's not used to that. So. To someone starting out, I would say just one step at a time. Um, it takes 21 days to form a habit. So if you can be consistent with breakfast 21 days in a row, then boom, you got it. You just have to start doing it. And be consistent with it and be able to tell yourself no you have to be able to tell yourself no when you want donuts and other stuff because i'm shoot let it be in the middle of the night i want ice cream but there's healthier versions of ice cream you can make your own ice cream you can freeze bananas blend it up and, and make it yourself throw a little chocolate in there you're good i want to get better at eating and 
I want to start doing meal plans and I want to get better at um, grocery shopping. And what do I shop for? Um, I'm really excited just because it's something to learn, but then at the same time, it's like something to learn. You know, so it's a little scary, but I'm excited to see what's in store. The total came up to 5.92. I like that I said, oh, wow, oh my gosh, I should shop here more often. Shop at Ann's Produce Place today.